welcome welcome and happy birthdays to all you capricorn um i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back capis thank you for um the wonderful like shares and support all right capricorns oh my god okay i gotta do this um for you guys so um <laughs> Capricorns, Capricorns, Capricorns. Wow, beautiful. Okay, so what a reading. What a reading, Capricorns. This is going to be a powerful year for you, Capricorns. Okay, so what we're having here, Capricorns, this is just absolutely, absolutely wonderful because what is happening and what is transpiring, Capricorns, we are seeing positive alignment of energies. So Capricorns who were born from 13th of January until 19th of January, you finish your zodiac um, year. This is powerful and wonderful. Let's go in your reading. Mm. So for the Capricorns, and this is your solar year birthday reading Capricorn so if you were born from the 13th until the 19th um, this is your solar year you are going to be have one of the most powerful solar years um, ever and the reason why is that you have your own energy vibration especially the people who were born on the 14th congratulations Didi I love you okay whenever you finish uh, uh i love you dd um have a happy birthday your year is going to be fabulous okay dd um so people who were born on the 14 um you can see this beautiful beautiful energies that is coming up for the people who were born on born on the 14th okay people who were born on the 15th i see you're going to be very psychic in this year and it's as if you're going to be bringing in um new um on Vicklin, okay you're going to be bringing in new on Vicklin. your year is going to be extremely extremely powerful for the people who were born on um the 16th what we have here is the energy of the lovers so you're going to be having issues with people in the family and that sort of a thing if you have were having issues with people in the family i see this is coming to an end then we have the energy of the lovers and the magician, whatever the issue, the situation is with the lovers and the magician. What we're seeing going on here is that the magician, this is um, clearing up certain aspect and certain info um, situation. You're going to be very, very lucky. Then we have the energy of the wheel of fortune and the sun and the wheel of fortune and the sun affects everyone in every way. So, People who were born on the 18th, congratulations. People who were born on the 19th, congratulations. You are in for a, a, a very, very positive year, okay? So, we're going to go in your hair and look at your hair and see what is uh, transpiring. So, ladies and gentlemen, what is happening and what is transpiring for you guys? The people who were born on the 13th of January, there is going to be a huge, huge tower moment. And when I said a huge tower moment, is that some uh, issue situation you are dealing with in your life is just going to be um, just out of the blues, just removed out of your life. So whoever and whatever that was transpiring, I see whatever that was happening in your life, whatever was playing in your life, whatever was blocking you, is just going to be lifting up and it is totally going to be out. Success is coming for you guys who were born on the 13th. Whatever the issue and the situation is, I see something is being removed out of your life and this is just going to bring positive alignment of energies. So the people who were born on the 13th, and I'm going this one by one so that you guys can understand what is happening one by one i'm going this one by one so you guys can understand what is happening for you guys is that this is going to be a very very powerful powerful year okay so whatever the issue and the situation is 
I see that this is going to be a very powerful year. And some of you who were having issues with a man that is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, whoever this man is, he's been totally now removed out of your life he is now totally being removed out of your life and this is wonderful and positive so people who were born on the 13th of december there you were having some issues you were having some issues dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person whoever this person is and whatever that was happening and transpire now you are seeing um that uh, this person it's totally being eradicated out of your life. This is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, whoever this person was, and whatever they were doing, the truth has now come out. A tower moment is down on this person, and I see you cutting down whatever BS this person had done or this person had transpired in your life. So this is going to be good. So congratulations to the people who were born on the 13th of congratulations because here you're seeing the tower moment is coming down on an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius you are successful over this person you cut through the BS and the lies and the deceptiveness of this person cut through the BS lies and deceptiveness of this person and the truth came out so for the people who were born on the 13th you have the energy of uh, um uh 10 <laughs> Um, please write this down if you were born on the 13th you have the energy of 16 7 19 10 1 0 and 1 okay so a new start new start new start new start if you notice one comes up twice that is 11 a portal is going to be opening the lies and the deceptiveness that is going on is going to be transpiring the truth has now come out and you are going to be moving forward with a movement of positive energy so congratulations for the people who were born um on the 14th of january i see you are going to be taking down your enemies i see you're going to be taking down your enemies whatever that was transpiring in your world i see you cutting down taking down your enemies i see whoever and whatever that was blocking you or trying to um place you in a difficult position i see you cutting them down and i see conflicts is happening here a lot of conflicts is happening here because the lies and deceptiveness of your enemies is now being removed and cut down in this year i see you cutting out and uh, some of you were having an issue with a leo i see you taking this person down i see you realize that this leo has caused you so far um personal problem and social issues and deceptive situation that was going on and i see you cut down this person whatever the conflicts that was going on for a lot of you i see you taking down and removing you or the justice you or balancing out situation and you are taking justice in your end and taking down these people and these situations i see whatever that was going on clarity is going to be coming in because you have the energy of justice you now find out and see what these deceptive people has been doing and the clarity is coming in so be aware that this person who is um this person that is a um and 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 leo have done some injustice and the tower moment the deceptiveness the thing that you weren't seeing clearly is now going to be clear because you have take down and remove this illusion that was around you now you're going to be seen clearly in this year so the, for the people who were born the people who were born on um the 14 is going to be a financial year for you as you notice the two eight, the two eights it's going to be very financial 88 money is going to be coming in um this is the energy of the moon you really have enemies but they can't touch you anymore because you cut them down they can't touch you anymore whatever that was happening and transpiring they can't touch you anymore you cut them down whatever the conflicts is this conflict is going to be over so you have 18 which is 9 so you have uh, 8 88 9 18 and 5 
there we go ladies and gentlemen all right the energy of the moon um the energy of the moon some of you have really some regrets it is, it is going to be a year of regrets whatever is happening and transpiring I see that this is going to be a year of regrets whatever the regrets is and whatever the issue and situation is I see now you're seeing the truth now peace is going to be coming in and you're seeing the truth now peace is going to be coming in and you're seeing the truth of the deceptiveness that was happening and transpire some of you are going to be finding out that um, a scorpion had a lot of secrets a scorpion had a lot of secrets and um, there was some secret with a legal suit and now the truth is going to be coming out and I see you are going to be bringing um, this issue and this situation down because I see what you have done is to cut down um, a child a child and this is it some of you are going to be having issues with a child okay some of you are going to be very disappointed in they're very disappointed in a child this child has done some really deceptive things and i see um and it doesn't have to be a child it could be a new love that you were with uh, has done some deceptive things i see the energy of the moon where some of you if you're in a relationship with a cancer you could be divorcing this person and you have a lot of regrets that you ever got involved with this person so it could be a cancer someone whoever this person is uh, you are really um having regrets that you have dealt with this person but i see you're finding out everything you're going to be seeing everything clearly in this year for the people who were born on um the 15th so for the people who were born on the 15th this year is going to be a year where you're going to be seeing the truths and a situation is going to be ending and the wheel of fortune is going to be bringing you some success for the people who were born on the 15th um we have the energy of five we have the energy of 18 yeah 18 um which is nine um we have the energy of two where you're seeing true and if you notice for you guys you you guys are going to be very very psychic you're seeing the truth you are going to be very very psychic you have seen the truth and you know exactly the lies and deception now you're seeing the truth now you're realizing what has happened and what has transpired i see justice so write your numbers down again it is 18 which is 9 5 and 2 as we look at the people who were born on the 16 I see justice is coming in for the lovers okay so this is good some of you could be getting married it is definitely um, a marriage that is coming in for you guys so um people who are born under 16 i see you uh, a marriage is coming in and this marriage was blessed by the universe i see a lot of you are going to be having new contracts a lot of you a lot of positive offer is going to be coming out for you whatever that was transpiring whatever you were looking for i see marriage i see new house coming up i see new cars coming up i see new relationship coming up i see um um you are going to be get it engaged i see um pregnancy coming up for you guys so the people who are born under 16 this is such a powerful positive powerful positive year that is going to be coming up and this is just going to be wonderful because you found out something i see justice coming up i see and this is what i said to you guys a new offer of marriage and kin children are going to be born some of you yeah, children are going to be born whatever the issue and the situation is between you and your relationship I see an healing coming in I see justice prevail over whatever issue and situation I see definitely that you're going to be having an offer an offer is going to be coming in an offer of love a, um, a new car an offer of a new house an offer of whatever it is that you were hoping and wishing for that you have manifest that offer is definitely definitely going to be coming out so wonderful 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 ladies and gentlemen this is going to be a powerful year and this is what i was saying to you guys this is your solar year and because you fall in the week of the 13th to the 19th whatever that happens to any one of these people are going to be happening into you because it's a solar year so you are 
um, sharing the birthday of this year together with people from the 13th until the 19th. It is a solar year. So what is going to be happening and transpiring, you are going to be realizing that whatever that you were open for and asking for and wishing for, it is now going to be available to you in this year. So right after your birthday to your next birthday in 2021, it is going to be happening. Here we are, the energy of justice, um, with the lovers, a lot of people are going to be getting married and a lot of people are going to be meeting people and getting married in this year. So if you were born on the 16th, you have the energy of 11. So a portal is going to be open. So I see your spirit guides coming in and working with you. You have another two here. So there's a lot of portal and this is why so many luck. This is why you're going to be so lucky for the people who are born on the 16th. You're going to be so lucky and the luck comes in because there is a portal. A portal is transpiring and happening for you guys. And this is the reason why that so many luck is going to be coming in for you guys. So, um, so you have 11, you have 2, you have 6, and you have 17. 17, um, 1 plus 7 is 8 also. So again, you have two, you have 11, you have eight, you have six, you have 17. Let's move on to the people who were born on the 17. Money is going to be coming to you. A lot of money is going to be coming to you. Whatever the issue, whatever the situation is, I see the healing of your financial stability. So for the people who were born on the 17th. If you were having some financial issues in the last couple of years, I see this is going to be healing. I see you have done the right thing. Bim. Okay, I can't even, <laughs> the word can't even come out. Okay, so people who were born on the 17th, what do we have here twice? The magician, it's yeah, 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 whatever. You people who were born on the 17th, whatever it is that you want to create in your life, in this uh, um, uh, solar um, year, it's a yes, go for it. You are going to be, you are really going to be making money in this year. So people who were born on the 17th, if you decide to change career, if you decide to go for work for yourself, whatever it is that you decide to do, you go get it because it's a yeah all over. It's a yes, it is a yes. They're all upright, the magician. So you have the ace of pentacles, you have the magician that is giving you everything that you need. So you people who were born on the 17th, the magician is here giving you everything that you need to move forward in this year in a powerful year. It is a yes. Whatever you ask for, the universe is going to be granting you, okay? Whatever you ask for, the universe is going to be granting you. Now, whatever that was happening and transpired, I see um, a no against this person, whoever this person is, it's a no because they were in reverse. But if you want to start any business, any situation, if you have any legal situation, you are going to be winning big time. If you have any conflicts with people, you are going to be winning big time. So whatever that is happening and transpiring, you are going to be winning big time. There is no question about it. You can see this energy that is coming in, that you have a huge win. Money is going to be coming to you, okay? Now, for the people who were born on the 18, we have the energy of uh, emotions. But this emotions is good because what is transpiring and what is happening is that this emotion is being balanced out now. So, you are going through some emotional situation. A lot of you have been going through some emotional situation. And in this year, right after your birthday, you're going to be seeing these changes that is going to be coming up. Whatever the emotional situations that you have been going through, I see these emotional situation is going to be clearing up because the wheel of fortune is bringing you in a very, very positive alignment of energy. And it's going to be protecting you at the same time. So this is wonderful and this is positive because what is transpiring here 
is that some of you have been dealing with some emotional issues and you weren't aware of what was transpiring and what is happening and some of you whatever the emotional issues is or was you were dealing with these emotional issues that someone had created and now the wheel of fortune because you're going to be finding your balance again and the wheel of fortune is going to be taking you out in a very positive alignment of energies okay so whatever that was happening and transpiring some of you were dealing with um the night the night of uh, of 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 wands whoever this person is whether it is a young person or an old person it could have been a sagittarian um whoever this person is and whatever i see you have forward movement i see that you guys are going to be getting up no longer looking behind looking to the fore seeing and looking um before you and moving forward in a very very positive direction so whatever emotional issues and situations you were going through for the people who were born on the 18 you have the energy of the wheel of fortune right behind you is the tower so something is removing away and you're moving forward if you notice all of your movement is going forward and you're going to be standing your ground and protecting yourself as you move forward so this is wonderful and this is positive because what is transpiring is that there are a new situation that is happening for you there is basically a new situation that is happening for you and this is wonderful because what is happening and transpiring is that the wheel of fortune is going to be bringing you some luck okay the wheel of fortune is going to be bringing you some luck so for the people who are born under 18 we have the energy of 10 we have the energy of 8 we have the energy of 9 so 10 9 8 and um we have the energy of one so new starts new beginning wonderful a uh, new right away that is going further then we have um um you are successfully coming out the end of hardship the end of hardship so whatever was going on some of you were dealing with some hardship the end of hardship okay this hardship that you were going um true is going to be over i see the um whoever stabbed you in your back so for the people who were born on the 19th this year is going to be a very successful year because some of you were stabbed in the back okay some of you were stabbed in the back you were going through hardship some of you were stabbed in the back and now the truth came out the energy of the sun so you guys have a very very successful year that you were you're going to go through because of whatever that has happened and as transpire your burden is going to be over in this year okay so some of you were carrying a lot of burden the people who were born on the 19th of january were carrying a lot of a burden and what is happening and what is transpiring uh whoever you are out there I see that this burden is going to be over. You were placed in a hard position where deceptiveness was at play. You have now shown the truth to the lies and the deceptiveness that was transpiring. And you have shown the truth. The truth is now out. And I see um, that your burden is going to be over. 210, the sun this is the energy of your energy vibration for this solar year is the energy of the sun whoever that was having some hardship this is going to be over whoever was stabbed in the back the truth is coming out whatever burdens you are carrying it is now over ladies and gentlemen over wow what a beautiful beautiful year and i you know there is just so much deceptiveness that is going on and this is good um, because you guys uh, are coming out of uh, these issues and situation the deceptiveness that people were having around you so let's see what is coming up for you guys uh, stuck in the mud you guys are going to be removed out of the mud the lies and the deceptiveness of other people so whoever has felt as if you were stuck in the mud you are moving out of um, this time this period you're standing up 
you are fighting and you're moving out of being stuck in the mud okay so a renewal is coming up for you guys it's really a year of renewal um, a renewal and it says review the past and the per and 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 the present so you can plan a bright and new future understanding your purpose releasing judgment of yourself and others okay so it is a year of whoever that was stuck in the mud you are going to be getting out of the mud again you get the year the energy of the year a brilliant success the freedom to go in any direction a journey that is now completed so there we go ladies and gentlemen there we go ladies and gentlemen a wonderful alignment of energy that is um, coming up for you guys I want to say to you guys I'm wishing you all the best namaste until next time